Assalamu alaikum doctors. Today I am going to talk about a very important topic that is developmental milestones. So mostly students come across with a great difficulty while learning developmental milestones. But inshallah after watching this video, you can easily pin down developmental milestones on a page. So without any further delay, let's discuss the three tricks for recalling developmental milestones. So coming to the first trick for the developmental milestones. Let's draw the diagram. So, students, in order to recall the developmental milestones, you need to recall the sketch. Now, let's suppose this is a, this is a hairs. Now, the patient, the, the normal child, the normal child can draw a line. Let's suppose these are the lines. So, a normal child can draw a line or scribble at two year of age. A normal child can draw a line or scribble at two year of age. Now just focus on this area, this is a circle. This area is a circle. So a normal child can draw a circle at three years of age. A normal child can draw a circle at three years of age. Now just focus on this area, this is a cross. This is a cross, this is a rectangle and this is a square so a normal child can draw a cross it can can draw a rectangle or it can draw a cross sorry a square at four year of age so a normal child can draw a cross rectangle and square at four year of age now a normal child can draw a triangle at five year of age while a normal child can draw a diamond lines at the age of seven years. So this is the most simple and easiest way to recall the developmental milestones. So a normal child can draw a line or scribble at two years of age. A normal child can draw a circle at three years of age. In a similar fashion, a normal child can draw a cross rectangle and square at four years of age and, and similarly a normal child can draw a triangle at five years of age and, and a normal child, child can draw a rectangle sorry diamond at seven years of age so it, this is the most easiest and simple way in order to recall the developmental milestones now let's coming toward the second trick for the developmental milestones now coming toward the second trick for the recalling developmental milestones so these are the ages, age, language, grass motor, and social adaptives for the developmental milestones. Now, just focus on the category of the age. So, that is the age of two month, four month, six month, nine month, and 12 month. So, in the category of age, just more focus on the numericals, that is two, four, six, nine, twelve. It means we are like more focusing on two alphabets and the category of the language here will be more focused on four alphabets and so on. Now, in the language category, it consists of co. Co means like smile in response to the touch or voice. Now, in four months, a normal baby, what it can do? It can, he can laugh. Like ha ha, it stands for the laughing. So, it consists of four alphabets. Now, in six months, the, in six months, there is babbles, and nine months, a normal child can say mommy and daddy. So, mommy, daddy, it consists of the nine alphabets. Now, for the 12 months, like a normal child can say one or two words, statements. So, in two months, there is go, in four months, there is laughing, in six months, there is babbles, and nine months, a uh, normal child can say mommy and daddy and 12 months a normal child can say one or two words now in grass motor activity and two month old baby can raise head and four month old baby can rose over 
M6 man baby, he or she can sit with support. A nine month old baby, he or she can crawling. And a 12 month old baby, he or she can run. So the two month old baby can raise head and four month rose over, six month sit with support and nine month he or she can crawling easily and in 12 months he or she can run if a child is normal now coming toward the social adoptives so at two months he can recognize the parents recognize the parents at two months he can recognize the parents and at four months he can focus on sound focus on sounds and and six month old baby there is stranger anxiety there is stranger anxiety at nine months the baby could able to respond to his name baby able to respond to his name and at 12 month the baby is cooperative while dressing so i repeat at two months the the baby recognize the parents at four months the baby focus on sounds at six months there is stranger anxiety and in nine months the baby could able to respond to his name while in 12 months the baby is cooperative while dressing i couldn't find the best trick and for the social adaptives for the developmental milestones you can think on it as well but for the tricks in order to understand and recalling the grass motor developmental milestones we are having an another approach as well so till now this is the second trick in order to recall the developmental milestones now coming to the third trick for recalling the especially the grass motor developmental milestones and how we can easily memorize the grass motor developmental milestones now let's discuss the grass motor developmental milestones so what is the third trick for recalling developmental milestones now these are the ages and these are the grass motor activities now just follow the table of three like that is three six nine twelve fifteen eighteen so this is a table of three that is three six nine twelve fifteen eighteen so till eighteen it is considered as a first junction after that there is two three four and five so how how you will recall the grass motor activities grass motor milestones so for the ages just follow the table of three likewise that is three six nine twelve fifteen and eighteen so these are included in the months like it is a three month this is six month this is nine month twelve month fifteen month and eighteen month after eighteen month the, from two to five it is included in the year like this is two year three year four year and five year but remember in between three six nine there is also eight five five month and eight month as it is not comes under the table of three but you need to memorize it that is five month and eight month so that is three month five month six month eight month nine month twelve fifteen and eighteen month after that there is two three four five year now how you will recall the grass motor activities for these ages now for that we have a mnemonic for it that is what is the mnemonic in order to recall the developmental milestones for that we have a trick that is हमें रब से मांगना चाहिए वो वो रब है सबका सो वट इज द निमोनिक एंड आर डू टू मेमोराइज ऑल द ग्रास मोटर एक्टिविटीज एंड ग्लांस फॉर डेट यू नीड टू मेमोराइज द सेंटेंस दैट इज हमें रब से मांगना चाहिए वो वो रब है सबका इट्स सो सिंपल नाउ मेमोराइज इट टू टू थ्री टाइम्स इनशाला यू विल रिकॉल इट इजली हमें रब से मांगना चाहिए वो वो रब है सबका नाउ एवरी सिंगल अल्फाबेट्स ऑफ दिस सेंटेंस विल शो अस ए सिंगल ग्रास मोटर एक्टिविटीज फॉर द रिस्पेक्टिव एज नाउ जस्ट मोर फोकसिंग ऑन द इनिशियल लेटर्स ऑफ ईच वर्ड ऑफ दिस सेंटेंस नाउ 
Now, out of all this sentence, we will be excluding the this word, and we will be more focusing on H, R, S, C, W, W, R, H, S, and K. So this is the easy trick to recall all the grass motor activities for the grass developmental milestones. हमें रब से मांगना चाहिए वो वो रब है सबका. Now coming toward the baby age. Now if a baby has an age of three month, so for three month there is holding of neck. Is there is H H will indicate here that is holding of neck. So if a baby is normal, so the baby would hold the neck at the age of three months. Now, after age, there is R. So, at the age of five months, the baby is rose over. So, at five months, the baby is able to rose over. Now, at six months, there is S. So, we will consider S in two times. So, at six months, baby able to sit with support. At eight month, a baby sit without support. Now, after S, there is C. So, at the age of nine month, there is crawling. After C, there is W. So, at the age of twelve month, there is walking, walk alone. At the age of fifteen month. After W, there is again W. So there is walking backward direction. And after W, there is R. So at the age of 18 month, there is running. Now, at the age of two year, after R, there is H. So H stands for the hoops on one foot. Hoops on one foot. Now, after H, there is S. So, at the age of three year, there is shears and pedal tricycling. And after S, there is K. So, at the age of four month and five month, there is walking upstairs. And downstairs with alternating feet. So this is how you can easily pin down the grass motor activities by just memorizing a mnemonic by this sentence. That is, हमें रब से मांगना चाहिए वो वो रब है सबका. So I repeat once again. At the age of three months, there is holding of neck. At five months, there is rose over. At six months, there is sit with support. At eight months, sit without support. Nine months, crawling. Twelve months, walking alone. Fifteen months, walking in a backward direction. And eighteen months, the normal child can able to run. And at two years, there is hops on one foot. And three years, shears are pedal tricycling. And four and five years, the normal child can walk upstairs and downstairs with alternating feet. So this is how you can easily uh, memorize the developmental milestone. I I hope this video will help you out. If you have any query, please drop your comment. I will definitely try to answer. Thank you so much.